Hi, I'm Jim Craig with Planet of Mystery Productions, and recently in one of the online planetarium forums I'm in, somebody asked about converting a file from one format into another, in particular over to uh, MP4 format using the H.264 codec. And I've done this before using the open source software FFmpeg, but it's a command line piece of software, and the command line is a little obscure. Getting it installed and putting it along the path is a little difficult if you're not a computer person. So what I've decided to do is try it with another open source piece of software. This one is called Shotcut. It's like shortcut without the R in it. And I'll put a link to it below. And it is an open source piece of software. It's cross platform, which means if you run Windows, Linux, or Mac OS, you'll be able to do this on your computer. I'm going to fire this up. This is how it starts. And I'm actually going to take this to automatic. And we're going to call this one Icy Valley. I have a little video of a fly through of an Icy Valley that I created. And we're going to hit start. Then we're going to tell it to open a file. And I have this one on my desktop, Icy Valley. And there it is. And you can see it's a fly through of an Icy Valley with the sun shining in the sky. What we're going to do is we're going to click on it and drag it down into our timeline. It takes it a moment. So there it is in the timeline. Now we want to export it. So first we need to go up to settings to tell it how to export it. So we're going to go to video mode, custom, add. If you don't already have it, I actually have two versions in there. I'm just going to call this SMG underscore Roman numeral two. The resolution for that is 1536 by 1536, if memory serves correctly. Now the original one on of this video was in 2560 by 2560 for one of the systems put out by Spitz. Keep your aspect ratio at one to one because we, because we want a nice square frame. Uh, frames per second or 30 frames per second. If it has audio with it, it will convert the audio. This one does not. Set it up there. We get export file. Give it a name, IC Valley. I'm going to put it in the root directory of my D drive. Hit save. And up here in the top right, you'll see it actually happens pretty quickly. This is a 30 second video and it's going to convert it in under 20 seconds. If it took longer, I would pause this video, but it's really not necessary. And it's done. So now, if we open up the command line, command prompt, go to D, and I use MPV to preview things, IC, icvalley.mp4, hit return, you'll notice here, it's showing you that it's 1536 by 1536, uh, playing back at 30 frames per second, which is what we wanted. And so it's as simple as that. So if you have any questions, you know, leave them down in the comments below and I will try to answer them for you. So until next time, this is Jim Craig with Planet Mystery Productions, hoping that your productions can go as quickly and smoothly as this thing seemed to.